Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Minecraft from the Vintagecraft server. Where am I, do you ask? Oh, I'm just hanging out at the Jazz Cafe. It's kind of empty in here today. The Jazz Cafe, you know, the building that Hojop built for me. Come on, people, come on. Oh, I think there was something here and now it's gone. Anyway, guys, I've been working on my place. Let me show you, <laughs> please. <laughs> I'm not sure why my uh, my voice sounded like that. Please. Um, oh, before I forget. A very, very special announcement. Happy birthday to server member Amara Bella. You are loved and cherished by everybody here and uh, and everybody watching. Yeah. So, guys, I've been working. I've been working really, really hard. Yeah. Like, like I just showed you, I have uh, placed the rings on this side. That obviously didn't take that long. But I've been working hard on the path. I've heard your 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 cries. <laughs> I've heard your your requests for me to keep the path as Tiny Red had it, and so I have done just that. Let me show you where I've uh, gotten to. So I've got to about here. So we'll walk the path real quick and show you what I plan on doing. This is the path. It's all uh, very, very easily walkable. I've used the same materials that she was using. In fact, I think maybe we need a little bit more of this going on here. Uh, just something like that. Good. Uh, we will leave grass in certain places. This place, th this part here was rock. I was going to replace it with grass, but you know what? I like the rock idea. Also, what we're going to do, I think, is I'm going to clear out this little uh, corner bit, and we're going to have some rails here. Probably cobble walls, because I think that would look best. Um, and then you can just look out into the water here. That would be kind of cool. So we're going to do that today. Um, keep walking. I've removed all the torches, by the way, because I have placed... Um, glowstone obviously not lighting everything up just yet. <laughs> it's got uh, it's got definite dark patches to it, but we'll fix that eventually. Um, so yeah, go down here. We're gonna have some stairs going this way down towards that house and this house and that house. So we'll work on that as well. This should probably be removed right here. I have uh, I have a, a glowstone right there. This is what I've uh, replaced. Remember. Remember the uh, the quartz and the birch? Yeah, you guys didn't like it very much. And so we've gotten down all the way to where she built her path. I keep assuming it's her, but I can't be sure of that. So yeah, we've done a little bit of work off camera. Um, this took a long time. <laughs> it doesn't look like a lot, but I like trying to get it just right, it did take a long time. And I'm trying to like make distinct paths, but it's difficult sometimes because of the terrain. The terrain is, the, the generated terrain is very, very tricky. Anyway, let's get started with some minor things. Oh, and over here, let me show you, right here, right after this uh, little cobble rail that we're going to put up, there's going to be stairs leading up to the main path, and I, I think I'm going to start on that, act, or I think I'm going to get started on that, actually, um, because it's going to be a little bit tricky. I have to dig into here and make the stairs kind of fit in. I think we'll be able to do it though. If we start back here, we should be all right. I'm gonna need some wood for this. Pretty simple so far. I kind of want to make it turn though. So I think what I'm gonna do is, um, I think maybe three wide is too wide. Come to think of it, I want to make it turn. I don't know how to do that properly. Um, something like that, and then we're gonna we're gonna chop these off on the corner here. We chop this one. Uh, maybe do this. Ooh, yeah, that'll that'll work a little bit better, I think. Yeah, this is tough. I've never done like stairs. It's easier to do with with slabs, but if I do it with slabs, then the the stairs or the walkway up is going to end up like back here, and I don't want that. I want it to just be a couple blocks in. Um, let me see if maybe if I make it. Uh, let me get some smooth stone real quick. Do I have, I do have ender pearls on me. Can I nail this from here? There's no way. There's no way. Yeah, it's a little low. That's not bad. I think that's okay. What do you guys think? I think that's all right. Since this one is three wide, would it, would it make sense if I, if I place this stair like this? I think it makes sense if I place a few of the stairs like that, actually. I like the way it looks. It looks a little bit haggard, like some of the stairs are worn out. War, war, worn? Worn. English is hard. <laughs> some of the stairs are worn out in certain places. Let's do another one down here, actually. Ooh, I like that. Oh, I've never played with uh, stairs like this before. <laughs> never played with stairs like this before. Um, I wonder if maybe if we can do... Nah, that's going to look weird, right? 
Yeah, I don't like that at all. Let's not do that. Um, do we have two in a row like that, maybe? Ooh, that's like three in a row. No, I don't think we're going to do that. We're going to leave this one normal. Boom. Very nice. Oh, yeah. Okay, so now I'm just going to continue this path up through here. This this same sort of pattern. Do I have... I do have a glowstone here. This one leads to this house right here, which is adorable. The digs. Good job. Um, so let's do that. We have that stuff going on. I don't need this here. Um, this is Keeper Tim's house. You can see it's the Dutch flag. <laughs> the, the flag of the Netherlands. Um, so, yeah, he's got that going for him. I'm not sure what's going on over here, actually. What is going on over here? No, I don't want that there. What happened there? Yeah, that's gone now. I think maybe we got to fill in the, the corner. Oh, no. We got to fill in the corner here a little bit with uh, with some grass and some dirt. Just dirt. The grass will grow eventually. I didn't like the way it looks. Or I don't like the way it looks just like all flat over there. And then we'll put maybe a little bit of... Uh, yeah, there we go. Then we can put some flowers up here and stuff. All right, great job. Great job, me. <laughs> now... <laughs> Now I'm gonna I'm gonna keep I'm gonna keep pathing this way. Just about finishing up the path here. I think it looks pretty good. Um, I ran out of green glass, so I kind of have to go make some more. But look at that path looks awesome. I don't even know if I need to put a rail around the side. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. But speaking of rails, let's go ahead and do that rail over here. I think the cobble rail would look nice. But I'm not sure because that's it's really thick the cobble rail here. Let's uh, let's put the let's put this down here and check it out. Um, I wish there was I wish there was um, quartz rail anyway. Um, so something like that. But we could break it up and have it so that in certain sections, for instance, the corner sections, you can't get through it anyway, right? So why not have it so that some of it is broken up? Oh, I think that looks nice. There's this one too. Let's put a single one here. Hey, that's not bad. Oh, that is cool. Okay, then we'll put another one here and then one here. Let's break this uh, ladder that people were using to get out. No, cannot leave. Um, maybe even like put one up there just to finish off the job. Would this work? No, I don't like that at all. Okay, just like this. Done. This, this part here is a little bit exposed, but that's not a big deal, right? People... People can control themselves. <laughs> they can't. They don't have to jump off. I mean, I guess we could put... No, I don't want to, though. You know what? We'll just leave it like that. I like it a lot. Yeah, I really like this. Okay, good stuff. We're making some progress. The other thing I wanted to do today... We're going we're gonna to take a break from the path thing right now because that's a tedious, monotonous, and kind of a boring task. But the other thing I wanted to do is uh, is work on the the bridge on the other side. Speaking of bridges, did I mention I'm going to need another bridge right over here? I'm going to need another bridge right over here. I'm not sure what that looks like just yet, but it's going to be great. I promise you. <laughs> it's going to be great. Best bridge. i got the best bridges around. Um, let's go over this. I love the stairs. I really do. With the little, the little peekaboo sticking out there. I like it a lot. I'm, I wonder if Mossy Cobble would look behind there too. That might even work better. I might stick some mossy cobble throughout the island, actually, now that I think of it. Anyway, uh, up we go. Beautiful. Using our walkway. Uh-huh. Let's go over there. Uh, where is... No, the bridge is actually right over here, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Okay, so, you know what we need to do? We need to get a bird's eye view for this. Okay, so we'll go over here. So, yeah, I want a waterfall right... Ugh, right there. That hurt a lot. My face is hurting. Hmm. Four blocks down. You know what would be even better? I think that's a better idea. Instead of making the waterfall come up from here, which makes no actual sense, we'll have to we'll have to bust a hole through here, but I think it'll be cool if the waterfall actually comes there we go, from the lake itself. Oh, that's nice. Let's break that. Get a little bit more water spreadage. Uh, there we go. Gonna have to sort of, um, sort of mold this waterfall a little bit. Uh, maybe even like just just a couple of them here. 
We don't want it to be super straight either. That'd be kind of bad. So let's do that. Okay, so let's see. From the bridge, or from here, is it wide enough? No, I need, I need like a three wide opening coming out of here. Like that. There we go. Okay, I'm cool with that. I think. It's kind of a... Man, water's funny in this game. Anyway, I think they're changing the way water works too. Uh, with the new update, so that's going to be interesting. Let's get these blocks, the half slabs especially, out from underneath the water. We have a little bit of water action going on there. I think if I just do this... Oh, does it disappear? I thought it would stay. No, okay. Um, don't. I'm not a fan of this either, but we can fix that in a bit. Probably put a little bit of... <laughs> by In a bit, I mean like right now. Probably put a, put a bit of that going on. Do we have some fence left over? We do. Here we go. Maybe a little bit of breakage there with a little fence. Perfect. I like that. Still seems a little bit too small here. Oh, that's better. That's better. Water's just streaming. I'm draining the pond, people. Um, okay, I like that shape. Let's have it spread a little bit more this way perfect break that let's have it spread over this way as well uh how do i do that no that's not gonna work i want it to go this way there we go that's what i wanted and now we have a little pond down here and I'm going to put some leaves up there, too. This is uh, this is the area that we're working on right now. Let's not get unfocused here. I'm more talking about myself than you guys. We've got to make a path this way. That's not going to work. This path is going to have to be rerouted probably maybe through a tunnel somewhere. I'm not sure. But let's see what that looks like from, from a distance. From a distance. <laughs> here we go. You can barely tell it's there. But I don't mind that. I'm not a fan of that right there. It looks like a little bridge. It just doesn't look natural. I think we have to fix it by adding. Yeah. Oh, not that. But maybe maybe some slabs on top of that. Something like that. I like that a lot better. And maybe even break the middle one out and put like... No, not that. Yeah. I like it. It looks good. It looks good. It looks even better now. Okay, I think I'm finally satisfied. Walk right through Dave's little uh, gateway here. And go over to the bridge. Oh, nice. Yeah, definitely need some greenery back here. I like this bridge, though. Okay, so there's a little bit of an issue over here. One of the uh, one of the loops, one of the holes in the in the side of the mountain... Looks like it comes through here, but I think I'm gonna close it off. Ah, dang it! I got rid of all my, all my stone. All right, I'm gonna have to rem remember to close that off. In the meantime, let's start adding some bushes, bushes, as one great man would say. Um, let's ignore the halves, or not ignore the half slabs. Remove the half slabs, and eventually, or not eventually, occasionally, we'll place some uh, some spruce. But I think mostly I want oak. I don't like this right here, actually. <laughs> it's Man, I am so picky when it comes to this stuff. Okay, there's another one here. Let's go like this. And let's continue this one over here. The key is not to overdo it. You know? Oh, no. Oh, wow. Am I in a one by one? Oh, okay. <laughs> Thought I was stuck forever. Do I have any? I do. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Uh, let's go, I guess, over to Dave's house. Oh, oh, right. I forgot about uh, the uh, in in inability to throw normally when you're on a thing. I don't like these straight lines. That's why I'm breaking them up, too. I know. I'm crazy. Here, let's put one there. Let's put one there. One there is good. It's not bad. It's not bad. Let's have one dropping down from here and maybe... Another from here, and I think we're good. I don't want to. Oh, no, that looks bad over there. Let's cover that up with one or two blocks. Man, this is hard. 
something like that. In fact, I'm going to even lower it up a little bit more. And then we'll put a little bit of shrubbery on this side. Maybe just a, one of those guys. It's looking a lot better. I do have vines on me. I don't want to put vines in a place where it's going to, like, take over. So I'll put some in the corner. Oh, and the water will keep the vines from growing, right? So we could probably put one, like, over here. Hopefully. Hopefully the water, like, won't grow over it. Or, sorry, it won't stop. No, it won't. It definitely won't. What am I talking about? I know how to play this game. Um, okay. I think we're good. I think we're good for this little section. I think I need some um, stuff down here. So, possibly we will work on that now. I think, you know what? I think I'm going to work on that now. I'm not sure what to do. Sand at the bottom here with... I know I want lily pads, but... It's a very rocky... Rocky. I think maybe all it needs is a little bit more variety in the blocks, and I'll be happy. Like, if I replace it with some cobble, which I don't have any in my inventory right now, for some reason... <laughs> if I replace it with some cobble, it might work. Let me take another look at it real quick. It's not bad. It just needs something. Hmm. There we go. That added a little bit of variety. I put some, some sand down on the edges here. Um, I put some dirt down as well. I think I want to actually replace that sand with dirt. And I want to replace um, that with dirt right here. Maybe a couple spots. I did want to leave some smooth stone and some cobble, so I think it looks good. It adds a little bit of texture to this otherwise pretty bland little, little pond. Um, but yeah, I like it. I think I did a good job. Mm -hmm. I came back to spawn because I'm delivering five elytras today. I haven't delivered a vehicle in a while. I need to deliver five elytras. I actually have an order for, I think, eight, but I'm only going to be able to deliver five today because that's all the um, shulker boxes I could muster. But I've heard about something that's all the rage. Everybody's talking about Hojop's lottery, especially Hojop. <laughs> <laughs> um, and right. I'm going to I'm gonna bet. I'm going to try to win this lottery, but I'd like uh, an ex explanation from the man himself. Right. Okay. So. Yeah. Oh, nice job. Good work. <laughs> Thanks. A backwards jump into the water. Okay. So, have you read the book at all? I, I did read the book, actually. Okay, right. So, let me let me explain it anyway. Yeah, yeah. Do you do come that. up here? Because you can explain it way better than I can by reading this book, so people can yeah. people can watch. And if you're on the server, you should play this lottery because it's amazing, apparently. You should, you should, yeah. I mean, look at look at all these prizes here. 197. Who, what was the biggest winner? Uh, Melancholy. Oh, this my one, goodness. 621 diamonds. Yeah. Wow. There was just okay. one winner as well. Some of them have been split, but ah, that was the biggest. Bluggy. This, has anybody ever won twice? Sparky Taz uh, did. Sparky. Yeah. Yeah. Oh man. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Okay. So basically, what I what I do is I use a chorus fruit. Mm -hmm. Um, had the idea a little while ago to use a dragon egg, but Tilted didn't let me have the dragon egg, so <laughs> 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 which is fair enough. Mm -hmm. um so let me just grab one quick I'll yeah give you yeah a uh, next oh a demonstration we're about to get a demonstration one time only one time only demonstration here we go this is a really cool idea actually i bet right, collecting so... each one of these blocks took forever yeah it was i had most of them to be fair i did ask a few people for some they donated kindly but nice. um yeah it was a bit of a pain i put a few down twice well i mean there's three of each oh I'll right yeah six times and so on hmm okay but um the idea is you can bet on three different types of blocks right uh up to three times three mm -hmm. diamonds per bet mm -hmm. and i do the draw every sunday wednesday and uh friday mm -hmm. i believe and um yeah so people do usually come and watch, which is pretty cool. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's it's really underwhelming because it's just a quick TP and then it's done. Yeah. But yeah, this is fun. Right. So how does Are this... Ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Okay. I don't even know Basically. eating Cora's fruit TP'd you, to be honest with you. Yeah, I, I actually only found out like when I joined the server pretty much. And it's like so, to a random location? So basically, if I eat one... Yeah. Look see, I land over here. And so you landed on, I guess, smooth so, stone. So you'd have stone. to do it again. Yeah. Okay. Also, the good thing is sometimes you sort of land in the middle or some like mm -hmm. this. But if I just look straight down, my... um. That's the block. 
the, the pointer thingy. Right. Yeah, that's the block. Yeah, the, po the pointer thingy. The, okay, <laughs> that's, that's interesting. So, yeah, it's huh. uh, pretty, pretty simple because yeah. I, I was thinking about redstone and stuff, but that was a bit too complex for me. So I did not know that Chorus Root did that. Signs in yeah. here use one per one to three guesses. Oh, so you put up a sign. Yeah, I did have paper when I started it, but the amount of anvils I went through was ridiculous. Okay, I'm gonna go look upstairs. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna see here. Hold on. Hold on. Hmm. If it's eight by eight, isn't this a lot bigger than you need it to be? Oh uh, yes, eight either way, so it's oh, sixteen. Oh, so sixteen by sixteen. Yeah. Well ah. this is yeah, eight by eight, which is sixteen. Okay. All right. One, two, three. It's about that anyway. Yeah. I'm gonna go with hmm, pink wool, uh, birch and sand. That's what I'm doing. I'm doing it. Nice, nice. Pink wool, birch and diamond. sand. It's a diamond each, you said? Or, uh, sorry, three diamonds, three diamonds each. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I will put that, I guess, over here. Yep. So, anyway, it's fine. Vintage beef, sand, pink wool. And what was the other one I said? Oh, birch. Oh, birch. Uh, I'm going to say birch planks. Birch planks. Oh, yeah, yeah, because there is logs too. Right. Done. And now I put the diamonds where? In the, in the hopper. Uh, yeah, just in the hopper. So I'll go, I'll go nine diamonds. The the this is going to be well worth it because I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to win all kinds of money. Yeah, I haven't rigged this. Don't worry. Definitely. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Thanks for the explanation, dude. It's all right. All I'll right. just check the uh, jackpot quickly. Oh, oh! You can check how much is in there right now. Yeah. If uh, the obsidian takes a while to break, there we go. Okay, it says sixty-four. Yeah, sixty-four, sixty-nine at the moment. Sixty-nine diamonds right now. Okay. Yeah. All right. All right. And the good thing is, if you don't win, then it will just roll over till next time. Mm -hmm. Is that what happened with uh, with who was yeah, the last that was... person? Melancholy. Oh man, that's cool. That is really cool. This is a great idea. Awesome. Thank you. Delivering these elytras or these cars, I should say, is a lot easier when you have elytra, an actual elytra on you. So let's see. 900 and something, 700 and something is where I'm going. Um, and plus, I get to see more of the server this way. Okay, let's go again here. 900 versus 700. So let's go a little bit this way. Ooh, look at this little town. We got. Is this. Oh yeah, this is 700, no, this is not 700, 700 town, <laughs> as I like to call it. Uh, 900, 700, ooh, it's going to be here, I think. Uh, possibly, possibly. This is the only, okay, well, maybe. <laughs> Let's see. What is this? What is going on here? Uh, where was it? The first one was 946, 741. Nine, oh, wait, 741 is this way. 946 is about here. Okay, so we can... It's right over here. Huh. 741. Oh, almost nailed it. And 946, which means it's going to be over this way. Okay, I'm going to build this bike. He's got a garage for it. That is awesome. 946, 741. Yep, he wants me to build it in the garage. That's so cool. That's so cool. Okay, this shouldn't take long at all. That's why I'm delivering all these elytras today because they don't take very long to deliver. I think I did that wrong already. Um, and uh, and yeah, I can like I can like build them so I don't have to. Oh no, I think I had it right the first time. Dang it. He wanted it in red. Ooh, and I did have it right. The I had it right the second time. It's two spaces in between. Let's see. It is lock spend. Lock spend's place. You now have a VB Elytra in your garage. And I'm going to go ahead and uh, and put the box in, that it came in right here. Uh, no, let's put it standing like a normal box. There you go. Oh, no. I'm sorry. Locks. Oh, he's going to be so mad at me. Oh, I think that's the actual um, painting that was on. How about we put it here? There we go. You get your certificate of beef authenticity, and you get your receipt. Where's your receipt at? I got to I gotta put another one down. Uh, there, uh, Elytra Red. Yeah, this is the one. 946, 741. Boom. Receipt and certificate of beef authenticity on to the next delivery. It actually looks really good in red. It's Paz's new humble home. And now she, she or he has, um, a VB Elytra in orange inside of their house. <laughs> uh, the coordinates that I was given were actually, like, over here or something. 
And I'm assuming they meant just to like put it in a box somewhere at the base, but I decided to build it inside the house. So I hope you enjoy. <laughs> hope you enjoy having a motorcycle inside your inside your uh, in your home. I'm sure it won't fit through the front door. On to the next delivery. Look at this town. Oh my gosh, this is gorgeous. Oh, I just want to look at it. Oh, this is beautiful. Oh, okay, I landed. I didn't mean to land, but I kind of have to take a break here and take a look at it. Mmm, very nice. I believe this is Sinardan's place, by the way. I've been here before. It just gets better every time I visit. Or at least it looks like it gets better. It might just stay the same, but I'm always super impressed every time I visit. Sinardan, you are amazing. He's... Uh-oh. Oh, no! Well, so much for riding the Electra. Electra? My gosh. The elytra the rest of the way. I think I have to take portals now. Ooh, that's going to be annoying. Um, hmm. Maybe what I'll do is I'll go and mend it. Dang, that's a shame. Um, I don't even know what I did with my chest piece. Anyway, Cinder Dan, nice place you got here. Uh, where is your portal, though? Now I got to I gotta head into... How close am I? Minus... Oh, I'm still like 500 blocks away on the Z coordinate. So it's going to be a while. The next one's at minus 2,800, minus 2,500, so it should be about here. 28, 26. I'm a little bit off. Uh, there it is. 28, 35, 25, 61. 28, 25. 25, 61. Here's 25, 61 and 28, 25. Ooh. Is it over here? Skeleton farm? 28, what is it again? It's the third one down I'm looking at. No, sorry, fourth one down. 2835, 2561. 2835. <laughs> as this zombie tries to murder me. 2561. Boom. Boom. Right here. Right right here. This is where they want it. This is where I will build it. I shall build you a BB Elytra in what color is that one? In green. In green. Now that's a. Uh, Lime green. So here's the thing. When they when people are saying green, I'm assuming. Oh no! I just used a bunch of uh, quartz to repair my elytra, and I left all the quartz back at home. <sighs> luckily, luckily, this is not very far from my place. I gotta go and get some quartz. Ah, dang it. Okay, delivered. On to the next one. Look at that cool, cool Tudor style house. I love it. Anyway. Three, oh, wait, this might be it, actually. This might be it. Hold on. First one, minus 2465, 328, minus 2465, 328. Inside the building? Where's the door? Where's the Where's the door? To, is, is, did they give a, 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 a Y coordinate? No. So, I'm assuming it's inside... Home of Stenstone! Uh, 328 is like right in the middle of... <laughs> 2465, 320 is right here. Okay, so he probably does not want it built. But you know what? I'm going to build it anyway, Sten, just because I love you. Cyan! Ugh. Ugh. Uh, we might have a bit of an issue. I don't have the cyan wool on me. Huh. I was just kidding. I totally had cyan wool. I... I didn't accidentally stumble upon your storage room and take a cyan wool block. Nope, it was fine. I had cyan wool. I was well prepared. I was totally well prepared. This is a cool house, though. Holy crap. I'm going to make this my thumbnail and pretend that I built it. Because that's what I do. I do cheaty stuff like that. Hold on. I got to get up higher, though. I, let's just use the glowstone to pillar. Because we have one more delivery to make, by the way. Um... And then, and then maybe some other stuff. It depends on how long I've been recording. I don't think I've been recording that long, possibly. Oh, that looks nice. Holy crap, look at that. Another amazing looking build. You guys are too good, honestly. I wish I could, I wish you could fly backwards. Oh, this is right by a, uh, a mansion too. A wood, a haunted wood mansion thing. Anyway, minus 1400. Minus four, minus fourteen hundred, positive four hundred. Oh, I think we went a little bit. Minus fourteen hundred. We gotta go a little bit this way and a little bit this. Okay, four hundred we've got. Now we just gotta go minus fourteen hundred, which shouldn't be long. How's my, ugh, my elytra's almost broken again. Okay, minus fourteen hundred. Here we come. What are we gonna see on the way there? This is all very exciting. Here's another little uh, forest build. 
Oh, I think that's the house I went to before. Maybe. I can't remember now. I, I wish I could turn around and look at it. Minus 1,400. 700? Wait, was it 700 or 400? 400. Minus 1,400, 400. Okay. So we are practically here. Let's get the exact cohorts. 1,424, 400s. 1,424, 400s. Are we going the right way? Yes. 1,424... Four, here we go. Here's the, ooh, four hundred. Fourteen twenty-four, four hundred is fourteen twenty-four, four hundred is actually inside this wall. So what I'm gonna do here? Wow, what happened here? This is this a prank? This might be a prank. Whatever it, is, whatever it is, it looks awesome. Um, I'm gonna build it. I'm gonna build it. Ooh, you got a little. You got a little whatever this is. Um, let me build it like out here. I'm gonna build it out here. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. Uh, I think I have enough room. I have enough room. We're gonna build the front wheel right there. We'll do the other wheel right there. You can feel free to move it if you uh, if you want to move it, guys. Check it out. I can build this thing like with my eyes closed now. You know, before I'd have to look at screenshots of my own build. Oh, what color did they want? 1400 400 purple lucky for you i have some purple wool Ooh, looks good in purple too it's almost as if this vehicle looks good in every color and you should purchase one if you're on the server oh by the way speaking of the server we now have an official modded server i'll probably be doing some visits over there um i can't say that i'll play on there uh necessarily like as a series uh green green Purple, there we go, and Certificate of Beef Anticity. Uh, but you should totally check it out. I'll put a link in the description to the uh, mod pack. We have an official mod pack, and it's full of amazing stuff. These are all orders, okay. And then I have 27 Certificates of Beef Anticity. Um, a final bike delivered for today. It's looking really, really good. Oh, yeah, this is a great, this is a cool area, actually. Who says this? Home of Kofefe. Remember that meme? Uh, Krav... Krafy. Kra eh, I thought maybe it was like a back... It was backwards, but it's not. Anyway. This is cool. I kind of like this. He's got a jungle temple right there too, huh? Wow, this is... Uh, this place... This place has been burnt to a crisp. Big... Big dead bush. Yeah, no kidding. I've been taking screenshots over here. Maybe this will be my thumbnail. This is more clickbaity. Because <laughs> people are going to think I got pranked. <laughs> ah, if you're watching till the end of the video, thumbs up for uh, getting fooled by the thumbnail. Maybe. I don't know. Maybe not. Anyway, I'm going to end the episode here, guys. There's the there's the bike in purple. Looks really, really good. Um, yeah, we did a lot today. We checked out uh, Ho-Chop's lottery and we entered. Hopefully we win. Uh, we did the waterfall by the bridge. Uh, we did paths, which was nice. I got to continue with the paths. The paths are a little bit tedious. So if anybody on the server wants to help, actually, now that you know the pattern, it's not really a pattern, but now that you know the materials, um, feel free. No, actually don't help because there's some things that I want to do that you might, uh, might end up getting like destroyed if you help me. And then I have to like take it all down. So yeah. And, uh, and we delivered five VB Elytras. We've only got about, uh, well, we got three more VB Elytras and I think there's only five or six cars left to deliver that were purchased. So we're doing pretty well. Hope you guys enjoyed this wonderful, wonderful episode and I'll see you in the next one. Thumbs up for dead bushes.